everybody, welcome back. We're an emperor now. Uh, between episodes, I just looked at the map a little, and it finally updated our color. Uh, apparently, we are this weird bubblegum pink now. Um, I know that whenever you get a new title, there's a chance that uh, your color will change. It's just weird that we went bubblegum pink, considering we just made an empire, like a custom empire. But holy shit, we're the only Catholic empire. Uh, which means it's... Time we start taking more land. Will you vassalize? No, I don't think anyone here is gonna vassalize, even the ones that like me. The power difference is really big, which is nice, but between not de jure foreign culture, and base reluctance, like, ah, We can create a lot of titles. Um, we can create a duchy right there. Did, is that all owned by the same person? Yeah, duchy. Come on, can I create any, I can make a titular kingdom. Uh, I can create that. I'm just, you know, double checking to make sure I can't create a duchy that's, uh, that would get my vassal limit down. But it's not looking like it. Alright. And I can't usurp anything right now because people are at war. But seriously, holy shit. We are an empire. This is awesome. This is hard in my crone focus, right? Yeah, okay. This is awesome. We're an empire now. Um, so our goals right now, we want to upgrade this castle more. We need to pay off our debt again, because we did just, um, castle town go. We do need to pay off our debt again, because we did just have, um, we did just take out money with Jewish moneylenders. So get some money. Declared war Luxembourg. Okay. War for Luxembourg. Your wife has sent you a gift, a small puppy. Nice is what we needed, because it gives you health. I will accept the gracious gift. Name him Faithful. Hopefully this dog isn't a psycho like our last one. Marshall discovered a man of great military talents. I will gladly have him. All right, I think we want to split up our retinue again. Oh, do we get any like bonus here or anything? Yeah, we can have more retinue. Uh, cost to create. We don't have the money to create it yet, but we have a higher rent new cap, and I bet you that is partly from, uh, yeah, I think that's partly from how we're an emperor now. That is awesome. So I am a much, much, much higher rank than everyone else now. I have like 500 kingdoms. I love it. Why do people who hate me hate me out of curiosity? Outraged by succession law change. Yeah, basically until I die, people are going to hate me for that. Now people want kingdoms, and it's not as big of a deal if someone were to get a kingdom. Because I'm the emperor. King's answer to me. Ah, oh, they ended their war. That's a shame. They still don't have many troops, actually. Huh. And we can usurp that. I mean, that's really tempting. But I'm a little worried about money. We need to develop a little bit. I want to get this other holding built. Especially now that we can have a domain of 10. Which is awesome. Probably need to spend some of these cultural advances at some point. It's just... Oh, Kingdom of Voice Royalties. Um, that's because we are a, an emperor, isn't it? So we can finally get something out of that. Uh, that's really tempting then. I'm pretty sure that is like... I can have kingdoms below me or something? You know, fuck it, let's just do it. We'll see what it is. And if that wasn't a good, uh, if that wasn't a great thing to put that into, it never hurts to be higher up on legalism. Here we go. Emperors can grant kingdoms or duchies to vassals as vice royalties. Such grants are not inherited and will revert back to the emperor when the viceroy, viceroy dies. It's a handy way of staying below your vassal limit. Okay, so I can temporarily hand things out to stay below my vassal limit. That's awesome, actually. That's gotta be really good as the kingdom gets bigger, bigger, right? So right now it's none. Later I can change that to uh, enable for kingdoms and then later duchies. This lowers my vassal limit in general though, which kind of sucks. Eight or higher for duchies. Ouch. Okay, so I can temporarily hand off kingdoms later. Okay. So that's not immediately useful, but at least we know how it works. I can temporarily hand off kingdoms later to deal with my vassal limit. Okay. Still, though, feels good being an emperor on above all of this. Yeah. Now, this does mean we could get claims... 
to kingdoms. Do the war for it, and if they're a vassal, they become that king and uh, are under our control. We could just we could just take all of Scotland. Uh, do we have a claim on all of Scotland? No, it doesn't look like it. Are there claimants for Scotland? Because I'd love a claim on Scotland. Like you. You got a weak claim on Scotland. Uh, but you, you've you got a male leader, right? Yeah, male leader, and he's not in jail or infirm or anything, so I wouldn't be able to press that. Still. Man, the opportunities that have just opened up to us are so good. Like, what can I take from you? I could force vassalize, yeah. As long as they're lower tier than you or below 30 realm size. Ah, I'd lose a lot of prestige doing that. No, thanks. Um, do you have any claimants? Yes. Strong claim. I could take you and then just take all that land. At the same time, it's only three pieces of land. I've got bigger fish to fry, you know? Hey, but you regret not getting that fucking non-aggression pact with me now. I'm going to offer it again because I want allies. Hey, you. Would you be willing to just... In fact... Can I vassalize? Considering another offer from us. He probably would say no, though. Um, Germany. I wouldn't mind getting Germany back in the fold. You want to be vassalized by me? I'm a king! Yeah? And? I could claim you. Could probably uh, take you out really easily, actually. I do even have a de jure claim. You'd team up with the Barivia, which I can actually usurp that once they're not at a war. In fact, I probably will usurp that once they're not in a war. Should I usurp this right now, though? I kind of rather just holy war them. Once we have more money, that is. You would say no? You would not accept? Really? You would? Oh, offer vassalization. I... I meant to click form alliance. I was gonna say, really, you don't want an alliance with me? There, you have a, you're getting an alliance with an emperor now. There you go. Praise is a good character. Good, we're gonna have a dog who's not a fucking psycho. Okay, you've already got a castle town building. Good. Let's save up the money to get our last castle built here. I think before this war, we want another castle building. Because we gotta make sure that we're always rising upwards and quickly. I mean, we can't even afford to have all of our troops up unless we start making more money. Because we have a lot of troops. Uh, pirates. Great, we're immediately getting the thing that might make the alliance break off. And it has a random event that just happened of you make less money. Fucking wonderful. What are the chances I'd get it that fast? Send Edward to hide him. Guess there's a plot to kill him. Uh, we have someone in prison. Ransom him for 10 bucks. I don't care. Oh, someone's trying to fabricate a claim on me? Stop it. Uh, what else? Someone's trying to kill my son? Stop it. Wish you would inform me of that, like, full screen. Hey, someone's trying to kill your kid. I should try and repair this? Yeah, lose some prestige, I don't care. Pay the ransom? Okay. Uh, good. You both stopped trying to plot to, like, fuck me over. Lies do hurt people, the truth. I think I can handle the truth. Okay. Um, so I've become deceitful. Not really a fan of that. County converted to Catholicism. Good. Okay. Um, he broke a pact. Are you fucking kidding me? I made an alliance with him. Days later, I get the random thing of pirates marauding due to having an alliance. I'm losing a bunch of my income, and then he breaks the alliance. Fuck that guy. I'm taking Italy one of these days. That guy doesn't deserve to be a king. Do you have any claimants to your throne? Because I got more troops than you. You? What do you have a claim on? Weak claim on Lombardy. Ah, uh, I wouldn't be able to press it on you. Fuck. I need to bribe one of your sons or something. Don't all your sons have a strong claim? Apparently not. He has no claims. Are you kidding me? What is your government type? What is your inheritance law? Uh, 
Line of succession, son-in-law. Oh, my son-in-law. Sh shit. Uh, my son-in-law is going to be on the throne. I might actually have a claim after he gets on the throne then. Not entirely sure. Vassal inheritance warning. Uh, what, pass outside of my land? It's, it's illegal to pass outside of my land. I'm not concerned. All right, do, can I pay off that loan again? Yeah, and I probably should. Castletown done though, and that's gonna make me even more money. So boom, just immediately get another one going. Cause that pays for itself fast. You know what, just march there. There we go. Emergency money, that's awesome. Let's pay off our loan. There. Fucking raiders just constantly. There, die, and then die. Oh my god, more. Matrilineal marriage. Your kins, my kin, own kinswoman and my son. Fucking no, I'm not having their kids be part of the other person's dynasty. Why would I ever do that? All right, um, court chaplain. Fuck, wasn't he also our physician? No, but our physician sucks now. Oh god. Um, oh no, he was. But our core physician sucks, so. We'll take this guy who's significantly better, and we'll also make him our physician. There we go. Fire you and make it this guy, because he's way better. Gotta have a good doctor. New mayor of Cornwall got elected, that's fine. What does he think of me? He actually likes me. That's pretty rare. Oh no, that's just a, a lower mayor. Oh no, he still likes me too. Yeah, that's rare. All right. People like my prestige. To be fair, I'm very prestigious. All right. Uh, if I were to train troops in my capital, I could just crush this guy's number. Right now we're- oh no, I was gonna say we're equal, but no, I still have a few thousand more than him. I can up my retinue too, and I really want to. I just need that other castle though, you know? I really gotta get my income rising. Raiders have arrived up there. I hate how often I'm getting raided. It's rough. Oops, that's, no, my guys, uh, okay, we can raise up these guys to, come on, game, can I not, I, I just, I did a second ago, C, right, oh, it's Z for local, okay, raise them up to deal with it, there, more just arrived on that same spot, cool, and I scared them off, and now they're going over here. Fuck, man. When are these people gonna fuck off? Again, I can negotiate with them, but then I need to get them a county. And I don't want to do that. Can't someone else give them a county? Get out of my land. The rating just keeps ramping up. Alright, looks like the locals are fighting them off. Good. That's a nice change of pace. All right, this castle town is already almost done. God, that's building fast. Do I have a local build modifier? No, huh? Scholar's Foundation, nice. That is building really fast. Totally served the king kingdom of Brivia. That's very tempting. Getting another kingdom under my belt. What is this? Order needs more castles in order to train troops and generate supporting income. It has come to my attention there's a suitable location in your domain. In my capital! I'm willing to pay you 100 gold in exchange for the right to construct a fortress here. Would you become the vassal, like the leader of it though? Yeah, because it's for the Holy Order. No, sorry. Um, I appreciate the offer, but I'd rather have a castle there. There we go. Immediately get another one going. Uh, okay. We already have a fort. Yeah, just making sure. Fucking raiders. Oh, you're already going? Okay, that was fast at least. I just really want to protect this land because this is where all the money is. Get off my land! 
Um, they've declared a war on... F oh, they have a claim on Flanders. Oh, right, because they still have that... Um, I really need to usurp the, the thing they have up there so that they can't declare a uh, de jure claim for that. Can you usurp this? It's not even that expensive. He'll probably say no, and I have a way bigger army. Let's just do it. Successfully usurped. Uh, title loss on succession. Why? Bolivia. It's seniority. So my cousin gets it. Uh, I need to have reigned over there for at least 10 years. Okay. Yeah, that'll probably pass. Uh, from my direct control, but it'll still be in my realm because I'm an emperor. So I don't care if someone else controls that kingdom too much. Uh, it's not really a big deal to me. I wish I could mark that as important. To be notified of when I can change that law. Is that the only one that's not normal? Yeah. Yeah, that's seniority. Such a strange thing to have it set to. Uh, so if my... If this cousin actually died, then it would go down to my son anyway. Would you get off my land? Oh my god, just non-stop. I might actually want to split up my retinues and just have them scattered across my coastline at this point. An apostate, some bishop who likes me? That sucks, because he's probably paying me the money then. Alright, burn ya. Okay, split it. Split it. Split it. Okay, you're 500. Yeah, get, uh... Get a 750 there, a 750 there, a 750 there. We'll keep the 500 back here. There. Guarding most of the coast with that. We'll be guarding more of it in a moment once I get another retinue upgrade. In fact, we're doing that now. Because the retinues are really important. Do we have any commanders on these guys? Because I don't want commanders on them. They don't need commanders. While well, the commander's at home resting. <laughs> Keep them safe, you know? Okay, we'll build up this retinue a little bit here before we move them. See, now the ships arrive and they're like, ah, nope, and they go away. Um, what is this? Monthly piety app? Why not? Prosperity as well. Not much money. Um, he's informed me of my half-brother talking shit about me. He's viciously slandering me. Do I have vicious rumors on me? No. Now, this will give me a reason to arrest him. What does he own? He owns a bunch of Welsh shit. Um, he doesn't like me. Yeah. It gives me the ability to uh, take him out if I need to. He's my chancellor. He's actually a good chancellor. I can tell him to stop back backing a plot? What? Oh, I can stop backing his plot. No. To abandon a known plot. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I can imprison you. I have a bad chance of doing it. I'll just keep that in my back pocket in case he makes a faction against me that I care about. Bohemia against... To protect Bohemia against pagan attackers. Teutonic Order has another county. Okay. Where are they? Or is it just counties within there? Yeah, in Bohemia. I think it's counties within Bohemia are controlled by them. Wow, that's pathetic. Uh, they're still tribal. Oh my god. I don't think any of my land is tribal anymore. I can negotiate. I don't want to negotiate. They can fuck off. Yeah, their ships keep arriving and then quickly deciding, you know what, this isn't where I want to land. Uh, lines broke down. That's fine. Negotiate with some other fuck. I don't care. Unlanded sun. Tons of stuff that I could create. I wouldn't mind Castile. The thing about titular kingdom is the older it gets, the more land um, randomly can become part of its claim because it has no claim in itself. 400 gold for that, or ducats, uh, that can wait. You become a flanker, nice, we got a flanker commander, we need those, those are good. Raiders, I don't care because they're not here. 
You know, you can have as many raiders up there as you want. My vassals can take care of that shit. You guys barely pay me tax anyway. Countess has inherited, yep. Really wish more money was coming in, but I have those fucking marauding, uh, marauding pirates for another two years, which is lowering my income by 20% in all my counties that matter. Raiders, Castletown done, good. Pick an ambition, see the realm prosper. I wouldn't mind that. That's a lot of places that would help prosper. At the same time, I probably want to do a, a war within five years. I'm getting old. Um, yeah, just another castle town. God, the income in that is really going up fast. I'm one castle town away from maxing it out. What do I need for more castle balls? Keeps upgrade. Which, the next keeps upgrade for that is level four. That's a while off. Actually, it's really cheap to just go to level three. Which is next level fortification. Why not? And then we're not far off keeps level four and that would get us better walls and walls, better walls means better upgrades on other buildings. So that would mean I could upgrade all my castles, get more money, get more levy. That would be really powerful. Okay. Um, I don't think I want to pick that ambition right now. I wish it wasn't so strong right now. We're still doing statecraft, right? The statecraft isn't as important right now as it used to be. Wow, you hate my fucking guts because I slandered you? I was right, though. Okay, you'll you'll stop being angry about it soon. So descent. Let's get some more rebellions going on down there. Really piss them off with their liege. So that I can take advantage. I already paid off my loan, right? I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I don't have a Jewish uh, money lending loan right now to worry about. Good. Just making sure. That no one in my church dislikes me along those lines. You know what? I think I might want to live with the rest of my days in learning focus or in theology focus because I still get the health, but I also have Temple Vassal opinion up and that'll help me get money because we have a lot of Temple Vassals and 20 is a lot. Let's do it. I'm gonna spend out the last of our days as a holy man. We actually have never joined a society this whole playthrough, and I'm kind of considering it. Could gain a little prestige in the last last bits of our life in the Hermetic Society. I mean, we're reasonably intelligent in learning. It wouldn't be too bad. The uh, Hermetic Society, if you don't know, is like the intellectual society of the world. I wouldn't mind, mind joining that. I could write a book in my last few years. I've got the money to. You know what? What the hell? We'll join. It's great to hear. All right, I'm a low rank and I'll never get a high rank before I die, I'm sure, because I'm still pretty young or pretty old, rather. Okay, are they just gonna leave right away? I think they're just leaving. Yeah, that's fine, go raid someone else. I don't even know why they decided to land here. Death wish. One of our commanders has improved significantly. Awesome, more, more martial skill for them. Good, yeah, by all means, go raid uh, the Umid. Mess them up. Great military towns, we got another commander. God, our marshal rocks. He gets us new commanders all the time. Love this guy. Um, happy our spy master has been around so long. He's a good one. I really hope he gets some uh, some more economic skill because I'd love to get improved keeps. I also really wouldn't mind. Um, what does we need to do? Next level of construction? Yeah, next level of construction is separate wards level three, which would mean our hospital upgrade. And as we saw before, our next hospital upgrade, once we get to the crazy expense of separated wards, we could start uh, getting these different laboratories to really increase our science even more. We already have the library, which helps with culture technology and technology spread. And we have economic through the translation house. We could get a chapel. It's more temple vassal opinion. It's very expensive though. I do want it. Because temple vassal opinion, it is important. Disease resistance, obviously important in the capital. And piety to liege. Um, as we start to move to like papal investiture, which is very tempting for me because I don't get much from them anyway. Um, that would mean that the Pope would really like me. I can start getting money from the Pope. You know. There's a lot of things that I could be doing if the Pope liked me. Like, request money. Uh, he doesn't have the money to pay it anyway. 
so many mysteries of the Catholic faith. Yeah, dedicate my time to reading more scripture. That's fine. Get some random events out of that. I think I could become a zealot, which increases... Um, I believe zealot is like bonus damage against people of other faiths, which would be good. And also martial skill in general, which means I'd have a bigger army. So that's obviously important. Right, we need to keep upgrading, don't we? Yeah, we can do that other castle town. Oh, but we can get another sit castle building. Do it now. Because that takes a while to do. And at 400, we can do that. Man. Ooh, here we go. Ancient wisdom for the next three years for one learning. And then, in general, another plus one learning. This, more, this extra learning is going to help us in our society. Speaking of our society, step forth with the idea that a ritual might invoke uh, the presence of a divine being. Ah. Uh, what if we anchor the being, uh, but we lose esoteric knowledge? All right. Secrets of the world should be laid, laid bare to us. We'll try and do this uh, thing. What is this? Surely deserves some recognition and rewards. Ah! He wants a county. I gladly give you this, but because of my high diplomacy, I can reject him without making him angry. So that's what I'm doing. Here we go. This is what it looks like when you have a society request. Uh, common nemesis. No, no, who I speak of. The idiot, uh, Musa. Uh, who is this guy? I agree, he is an idiot, because he works for the Umyad. Let's ruin his laboratory and steal his secrets. Yeah, sure. Fuck him. Uh, oh, I could invite him to go stargazing, though. I forgot stargazing is a thing I can do now. Can I invite my wife to go stargazing? No, they need to be another member of the society. Magus, you're the leader of the society. Let's go stargazing together and see if I completely humiliate myself. Summon the divine. Oh, man. So we can ask to know how things work. Tell me the sun, the stars, the gods, or hidden secrets throughout the world. Um, I want to know how the sun works. I have not memorized yet what all these things do, by the way. Um, I am less experienced with societies as I am most things. You'd be honored to come stargazing with me. Awesome. That's, that's cool. Wait. So what do you own? Wait, are you... Holy shit, the leader of the society is actually farther than the line. Um, one of my vassals. That's cool. It's not hard to locate the guy's uh, laboratory. This is the guy's laboratory that we're fucking up. Well, he's no time for keeping secrets. He does know how to hire proper guards. Okay, so I can either fuck off or uh, fail detection or succeed um, with the scheme. Fuck it, I'm gonna try it. We're a crazy old man at 59. Let's do it. 60% chance we succeed. Ah, uh, we'll totally botch this. Uh, consumption's broken in Holland. That sucks. Um, color me impressed. We managed to lure the guards away by setting off an alchemic reaction, producing the foulest of odors. We did it. We got in. Okay. I can steal the secrets or focus on maximizing destructions. I want to steal the secrets. Get what knowledge we can. As voted for Levy, Shift, Nobles. Okay. I don't care what you guys vote for in other counties. Uh, Divine Being has given me cryptic advice on the pursuit of alchemy in many forms, but with ample time spent mulling it over afterwards, I believe I have deciphered what it means. I'll put it to good use. Ah, great. For five years, my stewardship is down. That sucks. Oh, my domain max domain size is down, which means I'll need to give away a property after this castle is done being built. Man, that sucks. The next ca the castle's not going to be done for a year anyway. We don't have the money for... Right, we're still saving up the money for that castle town upgrade. Better than nothing, I pay 10 bucks. Or sorry, he pays 10 bucks. To me, really. More paranoid than I thought in any case. I can't detect anything of value. Well, he, he pays 10 bucks to me, so I guess I stole $10. And I got some esoteric knowledge, which helps me with getting promotions. Um, in the thing. Now, I can write a theorem, theorem paper. Yeah, if it's accepted, I get esoteric knowledge. It costs some money to do, doesn't it? Oh, I can... Right, I forgot I can embrace Castilian culture. I move from Visigoth to Castilian, which I'm not sure gets me anything, actually. Uh, I might do that. I'll consider it. So many random events. Now, this is why I'm not the biggest fan of societies, always. Tons of random events. 
guess has arrived. I look forward to the two of us uh, getting together and uh, reviewing the uh, the work of each other. Yep, perfect uh, thing in mind. How about a small feast in your honor? Uh, perfect location in mind. Let's hope the location um, excites him. So on the next episode, we see if we can impress the leader of the Hermetic Society. And we keep saving up money to then make more money because our new castle is awesome for making money. And this, these marauding pirates should be fucking off in February. Until next time, have a nice day.